Good morning, student. Today we are going to discuss about worksheet number two. In last class we seen tables two to five and so. So today in this class we are going to discuss about worksheet two. Dear student, open your textbook page number one sixty six and know these all points. Yes, first. A one draw beads to represent the given numbers on the abaci. Draw beads to represent the given numbers on the abaci. First one, this is what O means ones, T means tens. Yes. Here O means ones, T means tens. Here ones place three is there, so we have to draw here three beads on ones rod. One, two, three, and one in tens place. So in tens rod, you have to place here one rod. Yes. Next, thirty-six. Thirty-six means you are writing thirty-six like this. Yes. In ones place, six is there. So you have to draw six beads on ones rod. One, two. Three, four, five, six, and three is there in tens rod. So I draw here tens place. So we have to draw three beads on tens place. One, two, three. Yes. Once again, I will draw. Just wait. One, two. Three, yes. Next four tens and five ones. Five ones means we have to draw five beads on ones place. One, two, three, four, five. Four tens in tens means we have to draw in tens rod four beads. One, two, three, four. Yes. Like this, you have to draw beads to represent the given numbers. Next, B one question. Fill in the blanks. B one, fill in the blanks. First one. The numbers sixteen, twenty, twenty-four, thirty are arranged in dash order. The numbers sixteen, twenty, twenty-four, and thirty are arranged in dash order. Numbers are arranged in increasing order. Just see sixteen, twenty, twenty-four, and thirty is there. So numbers are arranged in increasing order. Right here, I, N. C R E A S I N G increasing order. So next second one a dash has three sides and three corners. Which shape is having three sides and three corners? Already you know which shape that is triangle. Yes. So you have to write here triangle. Second one, triangle. T R I E N G L E. Triangle. Which shape that is? Triangle shape. So next, all four sides of a square are dash. All four sides of a square are dash. In square, all sides are equal. So right here, all four sides of a square are equal. E, Q, U, A, L. All four sides of a square are equal. So next. A dash is a solid shape 
that looks like an ice cream a dash is a solid shape that looks like an ice cream cone so which shape that is cone shape that is a cone shape so write here answer cone c o n e cone first one is what increasing order second one triangle third one equal and fourth one cone yes so next next one point is complete the patterns complete the patterns first one square triangle circle square triangle circle so next one which shape will come here square so draw here square is yes. next one shape is square so you have to draw by using pencil you have to draw here square yes square triangle circle square triangle circle square so next second one 17 20 23 26 just see here this is a number pattern yes 17 Minus uh, sorry plus three twenty twenty plus three twenty three twenty three plus three twenty six so next twenty six plus three is how much twenty nine twenty six plus three is how much twenty nine so right here number twenty nine next D one state whether the given statements are true T or false F yeah. If the statement is true means you have to put T. If the statement is false means false means you have to write F. Yep. Yes. First one, the two opposite sides of a rectangle are not in not equal in length. Is it correct? No, it is false. The opposite sides of a rectangle are equal in length, but we are given not equal in length. So this is the statement is false. So write here. Yeah. Next, twenty-two plus four is equal to twenty-six. Is it correct? Yes. Twenty-two plus four is twenty-six. So this statement is true. Means you have to write here T. Next, third one. Patterns can be found everywhere. Yes. This boy patterns can. you can see everywhere so this statement is true so here also put here t next 45 minus 5 is equal to 30 is it correct no it is false 5 45 minus 5 is equal to 40 comes but here 30 given so this statement is false so right here f yeah. this statement is what false So right here, yeah. False. Yes. First one is false. Second one true. Third one true. And fourth one is false. So next, even Radhika collected thirty-three stamps. If her brother gave her six more stamps, then how many stamps are there all together with Radhika? Here, yeah. already she has she has collected thirty-three stamps are there already. If her brother gave her six more stamps, then how many stamps are there all together with Radhika? So just here, you have to. Right here, add here, thirty-three, thirty-three plus six, thirty-three plus six, three plus six is how much? Nine, and write that three here as it is. So answer is how much? Thirty-nine. How many stamps are there all together with Radhika? How many stamps are there? 
ऑल टुगेदर थर्टी नाइन स्टैम्प्स आर देर एस सो नेक्स्ट यफ प्रियंकाज मदर गे बॉट फोर्टी नाइन ग्लासेस फॉर अ पार्टी ये फोर ग्लासेस ब्रोक देन हाउ मेनी ग्लासेस आर लेफ्ट फॉर यूज फोर्टी नाइन ग्लासेस आर देर इन दैट फोर्टी नाइन ग्लासेस फोर ग्लासेस आर ब्रोक सो हाउ मेनी ग्लासेस आर लेफ्ट सो यू हैव टू राइट यर फोर्टी नाइन माइनस फोर नाइन माइनस फोर इज हाउ मच फाइव एंड राइट दैट फोर हियर एज इट इज नाइन माइनस फोर इज इक्वल टू फाइव एंड राइट दैट फोर एज इट इज सो हाउ मेनी ग्लासेस आर लेफ्ट हियर फोर्टी फाइव ग्लासेस आर लेफ्ट हाउ मेनी ग्लासेस आर लेफ्ट फोर्टी फाइव ग्लासेस आर लेफ्ट यस हियर कंप्लीट यवर वर्कशीट टू एंड वन प्रोजेक्ट वर्क गिवन जस्ट यू हैव टू see that project work okay till today i will stop here only and the remaining part i will continue in the next class okay bye take care